Basically, I'll be blessing you with a poem that I titled Changing the World Around Us. The world is a liability that strongly depends on us. We can make it resemble the way we want it. The world is vulnerable to change, especially by the way we influence it. We are breeds of God, bowling to fulfill his vision. The world is innocent. It accommodates everyone. It gives edge to every creation. The world is not evil, but filled with good and evil beings. So which segment do we belong? Which angle are we from? The world can be evil if we appreciate God with evil, and it can be generous if we choose to tread on the right path. God gave us the power and the leverage to influence. The sole aim of the breath of life is for us to represent Him fully. He gave us the ability to speak but not words that will bring glory to His name. He gave us the tendency to think but not thoughts that will win His kingdom. How active are we in promoting His name? How many bleeding souls have we won? How many broken hearts have we patched? How many feeble souls have we strengthened? We have the power for the blind to see through in Christ Jesus. How many eyes have we given sight? How many ugly homes have we fed? We have a task, and the task is to change the world around us. Not necessarily mean by preaching, because words sometimes make people feel bored. But the world can be influenced by action. You cannot preach to people about giving when you stand on the rock made with stinginess. Your service should serve as an empirical evidence that tells people who you are and what you stand for. Does Daniel still live? Who is the Daniel that can ignore the laws of the man-made king and serve the heavenly king? Are you ready to take the risk? Are you ready to be blackened? Are you ready to be thrown into the lion's den? Are you ready to be humiliated? Are you ready to stop to refuse to stop serving God even in the midst of difficulties. The world is a liability that strongly depends on us. Thank you.